With Apple's upcoming software update, iOS 8, only months away from a public release, many new features and enhancements can be anticipated by iOS users. Announced at WWDC weeks ago, iOS 8 boasts minor design changes but rather an array of experience changing controls and feature refinements. Among these is the new quick type keyboard, suggesting words as you type, in context to the conversation and recipient, but Apple also introduced new support for iOS third party keyboards as well. This in theory can reshape your personal typing experience on say your iPhone or iPad as you're able to pick from an array of keyboards and select the one most fit for you. A feature Android users have had access to for quite some time, this brings keyboards like the very popular swipe to the iPhone. Now as most people have installed the emoji keyboard on their devices, the installation of these new third party keyboards work just the same. Once a keyboard is downloaded from the app store, you can then add that keyboard via the keyboard section under general settings. Constructing words by swiping across letters rather than tapping individual keys, believe it or not, can save quite some time. And with tons of developers hard at work on keyboards like Flexi and SwiftKey, many keyboard setups should be expected by the launch of iOS 8 this fall. All of these new keyboards will take some time to get used to using, but can surely give your iOS device a new feeling when using it. And you can check out more iOS 8 news and more most definitely on coltomac.com. That was a look at third-party keyboards for iOS 8, but what do you think about third-party keyboards coming to iOS? Let us know on Twitter or in the comment section below. And if you liked the video, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to see more awesome videos like this posted 7 days a week. This has been Joshua Smith of Coltomac.com.